Hi, this is uh, Tutor Nick P, and this is Word Origins 157. The word origin today is shambles. Okay, let's take a look at the note here. If someone says that a place is in shambles, uh, it means that it is extremely messy. If a situation is in shambles, it means it is badly organized and does not function well. So you could also say that some place is in a shambles too. So you could say either in shambles or in a shambles. All right, let's continue. Uh, the origin of this word comes from an old English word, uh, shamble, uh, meaning a bench or stool, which evolved into shambles, meaning a table or stall. Okay. Butchers used to put up or set up uh, the benches to sell meat, you know, probably out in the street. Uh, over time, the street where meat was sold became known as shambles. So that's, that was the origin of shambles. So uh, they know that, well, this was always where the butcher would set up. So this was shambles. Okay. At that time, butchers used to throw offal. Uh, the poor quality parts of the meat often considered inedible. So I guess the parts that he figured he can't really sell, nobody wants. It was like garbage. I guess he just threw it into the street. I don't know. Maybe, maybe he thought the dogs will eat it. I'm not sure. Um, into the streets. The word shambles then came to mean something that was a mess or disorganized. So that's why today we have the meaning that it's a messy place or it's disorganized or a messy situation or a disorganized situation. Right, let's continue. And we have several examples here. Here's the first one. Uh, the burglars went through everything in his apartment and left it in a shambles. Yeah, sometimes we see this, we see this in the movies if somebody's apartment or house got robbed. You know, the robbers, they're not very neat. They're just picking everything up, throwing everything out, just looking for anything that looks good. So they don't care. Uh, you know, they're not, they're not neat burglars. Uh, so they leave everything really messy. So the apartment was left in a shambles. Okay, good. Uh, number two here. After that explosion, the surrounding area was in a shambles, or again, or just say in shambles. Um, okay, good. Uh, after losing his business and getting a divorce, his life was in a total shambles. So sometimes you could say somebody's life is in shambles or in a shambles. And number four here. The last CEO left uh, this company in a shambles. Okay, so maybe when he left, it, everything was totally disorganized. They needed a new guy in there. You know, goodbye. Remember I did the video on good riddance. Goodbye, get riddance, so long. Good to see you go. Hope the new guy's better. Uh, okay. Anyway, um, hope you got it. Hope it was clear. Hope it was informative. Uh, thank you for your time. Bye-bye.